Hello, greeting everyone. This is Rajesh Kanal, and today we are going to see the analysis of heat sink in NCS workbench. We are going to see temperature, heat flux, and directional heat flux. Now we are in NCS workbench. Let's start. First, drag down the steady state thermal to project schematic and rename first rename heat sink. Thermal analysis enter. Then, first of all, we are going to give the engineer data. We are going to give the aluminium alloy to the heat sink. So double click on it. Here we can see only structure is still it's there. To add other material, click on engineering data source. Here we can see the all the material. For the we are going for general material. And here click the aluminium alloy here. Click on plus sign. Yeah. Then on click the engineering data source. Here we got the aluminium alloy. Then to change the value of this, delete the already assigned value. Delete and drag down the isotropic thermal conductivity to aluminium alloy. Then give the value in Kelvin. Yeah, 170. Okay, now aluminum alloy is assigned. Then go back to project. Yeah. Then go to geometry. Right click on it and go to design modeler. First of all, change the unit in millimeter. Then go to XY plane, sketch, and normal then we are going to uh, grid we are going for grid and yeah both snap and 2d get yeah. then grid is facing 5 mm yeah, 5 mm yeah then it's good then go to sketching draw line draw the line here to here and go for here to here here to here here to you can design on your dimension it doesn't matter we are going to use polyline Then move with control and scroll. And here we go. Click on that. And right click on and open in. Yeah. 
we completed our drawing then let's go ahead extrude extrude boss apply sketch one and go for 30 mm diameter 30 mm excluding yeah here we can see then generate yeah we generated our sketch then we are going to off the grid 2d grid off yeah let's see our sketch sketch hide yeah this is our sketch then we are going for analysis cancel the part and let's go for model double click on it yeah now we are on ansys mechanical first of all go to geometry and see yeah our material is structure steel and change it to aluminium alloy yeah, that's good then go to machine we need to mesh go to sizing and select the material okay then go for element size go for 1 mm and then that yeah. here we can see the meshing you can make this smaller as you can but I am going to run analysis on that let's go for state state thermal insert I am going to insert it flux it flux it low sorry click the surface lower bottom bottom and I am going to give 5000 watt per meter watt per mm square then we are going to give radius convection to all element to all and value of 50 value of 50 we are going to give 28 in temperature then for solution we are going we are going to show temperature it flux directional it flux and solve yeah we see the yeah we got the we give the value of small then we are going to change the unit in 5000 convex on 50 and solve What can I see? Yeah. Here is the heat flux. Here is the temperature. The temperature is like that. Here we can see the temperature. Temperature is almost same. 44 to 43. Almost same in the and like in the heat sink then we are going heat flux heat flux is maximum at the end of 
in surface and we can see the animation like that yeah, okay and takes an heat flux we see that then we are going to this result it's no wireframe Yeah, that's it.